A neighborhood is still wanting answers after a horrific home invasion. A couple inside tied up, but somehow one person gets loose and turns the table on the intruders. Police have cleared this scene after 16 hours. 13 Action News reporter Tom George is live near Buffalo and Elkhorn. Well, they just reopened the scene just a few hours ago, so now we're getting a look at the house where that happened. It all happened right here. Neighbors say they heard as many as 10 shots, and they didn't know where those shots were coming from. They say they were concerned because they were afraid those intruders would come after them, too. The girl was screaming really loud, and that's what was so scary was like a, like a horror movie kind of screaming. That horror movie coming to life on this street. Heard a bunch of gunshots. My daughter was really scared because she could hear it. The windows were open. Matt Siaglia lives right next door and called 911 as the situation escalated. Somebody yelling outside the door, a name. Police say a man and a woman were tied up inside in a robbery. The man was apparently able to escape, get a gun, and then shoot and kill one of the intruders. Another was shot in the bottom and escaped. The woman was also shot but is expected to be okay. A little unsettling for sure, and but I knew that the way that guy was yelling, something pretty bad must have happened. Neighbors just happy the man stepped up to protect his family and say they would have done the same. I would have shot him a couple more times to make sure he was dead. Now, right now, police are still investigating. We talked to one of the people who was inside. He didn't want to go on camera. Uh, he said he was going to the hospital to check on the female victim, and he says she is expected to be okay. Reporting live, Tom George, 13 Action News.